Okay, folks, we're down here at the Bicton Bars, or the old Bicton Bars as they were known. You'll see all the, all the boats moored. We've got a houseboat out here. down here crabbing, fishing, swimming, kayaking, just playing with the kids or walking the dog. We've got a uh, protective swimming bath here with the, with the jetty around it. People can feel quite comfortable coming in here and going for a swim. We've got the uh, water polo and pool training just up there. And the Swan Yacht Club over here, where they go uh, head off out to Rottnest Island with all their boats, or just a day on the river. I'll just take you, take you for a, a walk through here. We're down here at East from Adel, folks. Nobody fishing, but still worth a, worth a view, worth a look. to be a, a, a really good shot here. Just the, the boats in the background. And we have a huge, huge house being built there at the front. You'll see, you'll see that in the background. Was that the massive house up the top there? Wow, look at that. Be worth absolute millions. All our little boats or people's little boats and tinnies that they take out on the weekends. Not only in summer, but some go out now. So we can see people got their, their little boats. See the houses across the other side of the of the water, other side of the river. Huge houses. Pretty overcast night tonight. Beautiful old uh, steamer houseboat there. Wow, what a beauty. a real good fishing boat that one just a a cray like fishing boat pretty sturdy pretty solid heaps of deck space and for the upmarket people we've got the um, sudden impact boat over here 
which is uh, I'm sure uh, I'm sure the captain when he's up the top steering this boat I'm sure he absolutely feels very powerful about himself what a gee well you would wouldn't you you'd feel great about yourself just being up there I'd feel great just sitting out the back hanging over the hanging over a line I was going to say hanging over the rod but thought I'd better not we've got Minim Cove and Houses on the river over the other side of the river from Mossman Park there. As I've said before, folks, a lot of money in uh, Perth, Western Australia. Looks like we've got a Rottnest Ferry coming through. This could be good. This could be great. This is our uh, island across the other side. It's about a uh, 30 minute ferry ride across to uh, to Rottnest Island. Uh, we'll try and get over there one weekend. I'll stay at the lodge and go out and get some uh, some fishing footage for you. But it's just uh, so many things to get done. Life tends to get in the way. But I'd say this is the Rottnest Ferry coming back in the evening. Water's just a bit cold for, for crabbing at the moment, folks. Just uh, that's why nobody's down here. A little bit too cold for the brim as well. They will be they will be hole up somewhere, but uh, have to go and search and, and find out where the big the big blue anna crabs are. Well, check out this uh, this huge ferry coming in here. Obviously they call them ferries because they ferry people back and forth to the, from the island all day long. Pretty much every day of the year I would say. Seems to be coming right in. If it's not a ferry, it might be a uh, just a uh, a function boat where they have functions on up and down the river. We'll get the name of them coming in.
There we go, people. The Rotnest Express. Look at the nose on him. Geez, you wouldn't want your girlfriend to have a nose like that, would you, folks? Oh. Just like a torpedo. The Rotnest Express. Obviously following the, the navigation markers, which is great, so we get to get to have a great look at it. I'm really hoping for you uh, visitors all around the world that you, you get a great look at this. Rotnest Express. I want to get over there and catch some fish. I'm getting excited. But you sure wouldn't want your girlfriend to have a nose like that, gentlemen. You could fill a nose with thrupney bits. The Rotnest Express. And that will go all the way from Fremantle, all the way down. It'll go all the way down into Barrack Street Jetty, right into the heart of heart of our city. So all the way out from you know half an hour offshore out into the deep ocean, from the islands, all the way in into the pretty much the centre centre of the city. What a great place place to live. Hope you hope you're enjoying the footage. There's people there on the on, on the back deck having a wine on the way back. Have a great day, folks.